Good afternoon. I'm going to show you guys how to install sidestep rails on a 2014 Acura MDX. I think the sidestep rails really give the MDX a uh, like a low profile, sporty appearance and uh, an overall upgrade to the vehicle. And I'm going to do it for myself uh, as opposed to getting it to the dealerships which will cut down substantially on my costs. Um, Here's a picture of the step rail. I went ahead and installed the uh, mounting brackets. If you notice, um, the step rail to the right is skinnier than the left-hand side, uh, so the uh, wider side on the left will actually be mounted in the rear of the vehicle. Uh, let me show you how these mounting brackets work. There's actually three brackets. For From this angle, you can see that we're looking at uh, the three different shaped mounting brackets. You can see toward the uh, front of the vehicle, the mounting bracket is very flat. Uh, the middle bracket has a slight curve and the uh, rear bracket has a, uh, has a notch in it. Um, let me flip it over real quick. I'll show you how these were mounted. They're very easily mounted. Two screws for each bracket. Oh, missing one there. Uh, I want to put something down underneath it so it doesn't scratch the uh, plastic or the um, aluminum, the polished aluminum. Um, you'll notice that the screws have um, no washers. You might want to install those or some sort of lock washers or Loctite. I went ahead and used Loctite when I installed these. Um, so this is the initial stages once you get these brackets installed then you can go ahead and mount it up underneath the, the MDX. And underneath the MDX, prepping the uh, mounting brackets is very simple. They line up uh, exactly in my case. I didn't get the um, factory originals, but I did get the OEM um, replacements. Uh, let me show you, there's only three notches underneath here that you just need to cut out with a uh, razor blade. you see here, there's actually outlines brackets where you want to go ahead and notch these out with a razor blade. Uh, there is three of them, two, and then there's a third one. Let me get a better angle here. There's a third one here that I've already cut out. Um, go ahead and cut those out. Very easy. It only takes you about five seconds they're already pre-notched so very little effort um, as you can see there as you can see here I moved over the rails laid them in place in order to make it easy for you to bolt down the step rails um, you can either prop up the step rails with something or maybe use a jack I have a jack but I have a couple of uh, styrofoam boxes here I'm just gonna prop up underneath there and so I can bolt them down into place. One of the suggestions that I make uh, is when you're bolting all the these nine bolts in, don't tighten them down until the very end. There's a little wiggle room to make sure they're lined up properly. Um, and uh, that way, once you get them all in place, you can just crank them down and get some torque on them. couple more all right now I want to take you into the car and show you what the uh, the mounting brackets look the good thing is there's plenty of clear height on this vehicle so you don't need to jack it up necessarily in order to attach these uh, these brackets just screws right in In order to get these bolts in, you have to push the brackets flush. Uh, then you can go ahead and screw these in, otherwise they don't line up correctly.
Here's the mounted front bracket, front right bracket. You see the indicator right front. Here's the mounted middle bracket, middle right bracket. And I'm gonna get ready and start tightening down the rear right bracket. There. Well, there's the finished product. Side steps, rail installed on MDX. All you gotta do is the other side now. Good luck guys. And there you go. There's a after install look of the uh, the 2014 MDX with the side rails. Hope this video was helpful. I'll go ahead and link in the description below um, where I bought these rails on Amazon. Uh, I think they were $600, 608 and change. Um, uh, again, they were not uh, the factory, but they were aftermarket OEMs. Uh, they were much cheaper uh, for an hour's worth of work and the cost. Uh, it's a very nice uh, addition to the vehicle and I uh, hope it'll, uh, this video will prove useful for you guys. Take care. Thanks, guys.